you can't compare today's game and uh, and the game against Spain on on Tuesday. Just two different matches altogether, and uh, we'll be ready and prepared for for the game on Tuesday. And uh, we have one thought in mind: is that we we'll want to try and win the match. So. After Lithuania, obviously, you said that you, were, you wanted the players to be a bit more clinical. Is it is that the only concern at the moment? Given but the it's, it, the you know, it's not a concern really. Uh, because we were in the position to score numerous goals today, and uh, and also against Lithuania, and you know, for me, the more often we get in those positions, the more chances we've got of scoring goals. And see, we have been clinical in some matches, um, particularly the ones where we we need to be, if that makes sense. You know, I'm thinking in particular of recent matches against uh, Czech Republic, against Denmark, against Spain last year. The harder matches, we seem to be able to find our touch in front of goal. I don't know why, but we've certainly been clinical in those matches. And uh, one of the big plus points for me tonight is obviously Craig McHale Smith getting a goal, and, and you know that's going to do his confidence a little bit. How pleased were you um, with Derek Fletcher tonight coming in? Ah, the I mean, training? I, I, every time I come off uh, after a match and do an interview. After a Scotland game, he's the, uh, you know, he's the guy that, in the forefront of my mind, has again, you know, gone above and beyond the call of duty, and uh, he was excellent again tonight. He, he can't be a hundred percent impossible for him to be a hundred percent after his, his illness during the week, and uh, so he, he does it again. Though you know, he turns out another fantastic performance, and um, yeah, just thrilled to bits to have him as our captain. As far as Kenny Miller's concerned, how much do you need to regard to Tuesday? And any other injuries? Ronnie, I, I, I don't know about Kenny. I mean, he, he uh, yesterday did he did fifty percent of the training session. When we did a little bit of shooting, he felt his uh, his groin ever so slightly and didn't want to go beyond that point, which makes sense. So we will reassess uh, tomorrow, and we will do we'll do that again. Uh, excuse me, <coughs> we'll do that again on Monday, and uh, we'll see how he is. Any injuries? Okay. A couple of little things. Barry got a knock early in the game, as you probably saw. His Achilles was was a bit sore. Um, and it's stiffened up a bit now, so uh, that was a little bit of a concern. Charlie took a couple of knocks, but I, I just felt that he was, you know, he'd uh, taken two quite hefty whacks, and I felt that maybe just you know keep him right for for Tuesday. So I don't think there's anything major, but we'll have to wait and see. I and mean, sometimes things appear after 24 hours. That was intention to uh, today was to to move into second place in the in the table, um, and now we are in a position where the the, the second place is in our uh, it's our ours to lose. Yesterday, miracle happened, Craig, one way or another, in terms of either you beat Spain or Lithuania. Well, we need one of two, don't yeah. we? You know, I mean, we we've got a group of players who are confident. Um, you know, we'll recover quickly. They're a fit bunch of guys. We're, we're going to, you know, we're in a position now that uh, I would have taken at the start of the the, the competition, yes. where we can, you know, we win the game. We we finish second. It's a fact. So uh, it is a tough order, a tough, a tall order, I should say, for for us to do that. But we understand that, and there's nothing for us to fear. <coughs> That's the important thing. There's nothing to fear. Craig, you say it's ours to lose, but is that? Realistically, with the case. Yeah, I think so. As long as we're in front, yeah, I know. you know, we we're in front, yeah, second we're place in the, the table. Yeah, champions. so we're, we're playing the world champions. Yeah, of course. But yeah. uh, we're in we're in a position where if we win the game, we qualify. Do, do you seem sort of incredulous that that would even think that's possible? Why is that? No, it's, it's, it's not just a tall order; it's an incredibly tall order. This yeah. Spain are. You know, yeah, I know that. One every game yeah. in this uh, competition. I know. This qualifying yeah. campaign. Yeah. What but we. So it makes you believe then, Craig, you can go and win that game. I, I believe wholeheartedly in the players and their ability to rise to a challenge. You know, obviously you said we'll try and do that, but there's a sense that we will have to win. You know, what's the chances of people getting down there again? Well, I, I, I can't rely on that. It's simple. You know, we can't. Go into the game against Spain relying on what happens in in Lithuania. Yeah. You know, we have no influence over that, so it makes it makes complete sense for me to do everything we can to win the game on, on Tuesday night. And, and of course, we recognise it's difficult, but we, I would say I say to you, we've nothing to fear. We'll, we'll go there with uh, 
with uh, quite a lot of, uh, of our supporters inside the stadium, giving us the full backing. And I can assure you on Tuesday night oh, that lads will run themselves into the ground in an attempt to to get that second spot. Thank you. He, he's, he's, a, uh, he's a late developer, and that those type of players really um, really excite me because he's got experience in club football and he's improving. So, and he gets, of course, he'll get a massive lift from you know to make to make your competitive debut for for your country and score the winning goal. I mean, he's, uh, his confidence will be sky high. You played. Uh your captain slightly deeper tonight, Charlie further forward. Yeah. Uh, certainly seemed to work, didn't it? Well, we, well, we created uh, a number of opportunities yeah. with fast uh, football, with changing the point of attack and, and also um, dominating possession for long spells. Um, I also aware that Fletcher was maybe not 100% and, uh, you know, I felt that Asking him to do those lung busting runs to get into the uh -huh. to the penalty box was maybe the wrong thing to do. So, yeah. you know, he, he played the role. He was excellent again playing that role. I don't I haven't honestly looked at the team for Tuesday. I, I put all energies have been concentrated on tonight. Yeah. Smith another night, Craig, maybe a little bit of a hat -tick and save for You know, Naismith got into the box more than any other midfield player I've ever seen tonight. Incredible amount of times he got into, and I'm not. I mean, he had some great chances, but the the point being, a lot of times he got in there and he didn't didn't receive the ball. But you know, he's a he's a real uh, tireless worker for the for the team. So is Morrison. Those two were, you know, making unbelievable amount of runs to. Morrison's got some great touches. Morrison's some great. Yeah, yeah, he's. I'm a huge admirer of uh, of James. So.